Welcome back guys, so in this video I'll be showing you some gameplay of Call of Duty Mobile running on my Redmi Note 9 Pro. I'll be playing the Battle Royale mode. My Redmi Note 9 Pro has Snapdragon 720G processor and 4GB of RAM. This is the CPU flow tab. It shows the real time clock speed of all of the cores of the processor. This is the RAM monitor. Here you can see the free used and total RAM. Let me show you the settings. Here as you can see. I have set the graphic quality to high on my Pocophone F1 that has Snapdragon 845 processor. Very high graphic quality preset option is also present, not on Redmi Note 9 Pro. Frame rate has been set to max. Hopefully, we will be getting 60 FPS. So, let's just start our game. I'll start the Battle Royale mode, Classic mode. I played the entire match on my Pocophone F1 at the end temperature went up to 41 degrees celsius and this happened during the winter season. It is demanding running the game at 60 fps with high graphics quality preset. Now I will be using the Xbox One gamepad to play the game. Gamepad works by default. The gamepad is recommended for this game. Virtually no dead zones around the analog sticks. I have enabled the MIUI game speed turbo mode interface. You can see the FPS counter here. Yeah, so now I'm in the lobby. 60 FPS, that's good to see. 58 FPS. FPS drop 55 FPS. So I'm noticing some micro stuttering on my Pocophone F1. The gaming experience was very smooth. Did not notice a lot of micro stuttering. I'll wait for the match to start. 58 oh, FPS again. Fifty FPS there for about a second. We'll be jumping down. What happened to the CP flow tap? It got closed by itself. You can see free RAM is around 700 MB, so RAM is not a bottleneck. I'll stick with my team. You can see 70% GPU utilization, 40% CPU utilization. Eighty percent GPU utilization, fifty seven FPS. Forty eight FPS, I notice the FPS drop. 55 FPS again, so there is a micro stuttering on Redmi Note 9 Pro. Fifty seven FPS, a slight stutter again. Fifty three FPS. Now. 
54 fps fifty five FPS while riding the bike. There was a slowdown there for about a second. Forty-nine FPS. All right, match complete. Decent performance. FPS was mostly around 60, but there were occasional FPS drops. The lowest FPS that I observed was around 49. Now let's just measure the temperatures. On the screen side, maximum temperature is around 38.5 degrees Celsius. And on the processor side, the maximum temperature is around 37.5. 6 degrees celsius so guys i'll end the video here i hope you found it useful thanks for watching and have a nice day